Hey guys, I'm going to be showing you how to get the Foeman. The Foeman is a hybrid weapon. It switches from a assault rifle to a suppressed sniper. It has 60 magazine and it also doesn't need ammo. It just recharges. One second reload. This weapon is a Even god. Say, Anyways, let's get to it. Alright, here are the materials to obtain the Foeman. So first off, you need two Argon Crystals, 350 Hexanon, 7,500 Anaspores, 2,100 Ruby Dues, which I like to call Rubies, and 25,000 credits. So right off the bat, the hardest material to collect is probably the Hexanon. The Hexanon drop rate is fucking ridiculous. That shit drops like every four minutes. It's ridiculous. Hexanon, it gives you nine, seven to fourteen Hexanon a drop. I recommend using Necros, but of course a lot of people don't have Necros, so I'm gonna go in here using Mag. Now obviously you can see me using Wisp at first. There was a glitch and I had to switch my Warframe. The glitches in this game happen quite often depending on what mission you're doing. But anyways, yes, Mag, Excalibur, and Vault are pretty nice for these missions. Now, this is a survival mission that I'm about to enter, and you're going to see here on screen that I load in as Wisp. Now, if you have Wisp, I recommend doing this, but if you don't have Wisp, well, the next video will be showing you how to get Wisp, so that's okay. Wisp is highly OP and really amazing, and of course, Wisp and the Foreman go together, and I believe you have a bonus damage or bonus speed when you go with Wisp with the gun. As you can see here, I'm going to run to the control panel here, and I'm jumping up and down. I missed the control panel because I want to go kill some enemies, but then I realized there is no enemies to kill because I have to go to the control panel. <laughs> but anyways, you can see here that I put the code in, and it, it Another glitch happens. It doesn't let me go through, so I said, "Fuck!" I'm using the cipher, and enemies start coming in like crazy. For the first second, nothing off, happens. Lotus talks, support. whatever she does, I whatever she has to say, and then I walk Stay up here, and then support. I see enemies in an instant. Now look how fast this gun is. This gun is amazing. It does great damage, and these are low levels. Wait till later. Okay, so in this clip, you can see me getting attacked by these guys. Now look very closely on these drops. You can see an orange thing. You see that right there? That's Hexanon. Right there, that is Hexanon. I'm gonna aim at it right here after I kill this motherfucker. Aim at it. That is Hexanon. That is what you'll be looking for. Just go over everybody that you kill and you'll collect it eventually. But that, that, that's what you really want to be going for. Now, this mission is also really good for giving other materials, but I mean, all those materials can be found on other planets as well. So here you can see the switch to mag, and here you can see me, I am... I can't see because I'm a little far. I am, I believe it's like 9 or 10 minutes in and this this gun is just ridiculous. And the crazy part is I didn't even have my actual build for this gun. That's the crazy part. But here you can see the hexagon that you have to collect. That is what you need to collect. That orange thing. And as you can see 10 minutes in, that drop rate is stupid. It's bad. It's horrible. It's honestly like Oxygen. But as you can see, it's very effective against these guys at 10 minutes in. Alright, now moving to the next thing about this gun. This is one hour in survival. Now in this, I'm going to show you how much hexanon I dropped. and I'm on, it, Well, it dropped. And I'm also going to show you the damage that this woman does. This is highly ridiculous. I mean, you can see the damage that this gun does at a high level. These guys are level 113 and up. Maybe some less, but this gun is still OP. Level 100 and up, and this gun... This gun is insane. And again, like I said, I don't have my proper build on it, but this gun is insane. So yes, yeah, so the, the topic of it is you gotta get the 350 Hexanon, and Hexanon is the hardest to get. It's really hard to farm. All you gotta do is just get Necros, and if, again, if you don't have a Necros, it's okay. Just run it with a friend, because you don't want to run this shit alone. This shit's toxic as shit. <laughs> but yeah, uh, run it with a friend and just keep doing this for a bunch of bunch of minutes. You know, if you want to go 45 minutes or, or 30 minutes, go ahead, do it. And you want to run this like three times. All right, time for the analytics and the data. So first off, you can see 84 hexanon. Now, if you run this with a necros, you will most likely have like a hundred and something uh, hexanon, and you only have to really run this like three or four times, and you'll be set to go. Uh, I recommend pressing start or LT or you know that that button, whatever button is on the bottom left of your screen, you click it or you press it, and your little menu the chat thing will pop up in your orbiter and just go to the recruiting area and ask hey necros anyone hexanon farm and most likely somebody will say hey me and boom you're there you're good to go you can just farm that and it's really nice you also have to be Master rank 8 to obtain this weapon however I made a video in my previous yeah it was a previous video that I made on how to master rank fast which is which works by the way I'm I was master rank 7 the other day now I'm 14 so yeah I'm on my way and I don't even play this game like that but the foreman is so amazing I had to make a video on how to obtain it 
uh, the next thing I would say is yeah get those two argon crystals after you obtain the hexagon because argon crystals decay after a day this is my build which I do not like I have to get a better one but yeah 6000 radiation is pretty nice but uh, yeah guys if I miss anything in this video let me know but I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial peace out guys by the way, if you're not Master Rank 8 at all, just get this material anyways, this will help you in the long run. Peace out.